Welcome to Learning Bites. We're focusing on dreaming big and what holds you back from achieving what you could possibly achieve. One of the most impactful statements that my Nana ever made was done during a muse that she was sort of reflecting over her life and in a discussion that she was having. In my mind, she was the most magnificent, wonderful person, quite incredible in every way. And yet when she was reflecting, she said, there's so much stuff I didn't do because I was so worried about what other people would be thinking of me or what other people thought of me. And she said, it's taken me until well into my 70s before I actually realized that nobody was thinking about me at all. They're all too busy living their own lives. And her encouragement to me was to, to dream big, not to be held back by what other people might be thinking. Dreams are great things to have. They give us something to aim for. We talk about the power of having your North Star, knowing what you're aiming for, knowing what you're striving for. It helps you to set your priorities. The thing with dreams is that they're there to direct you. They don't guarantee success or outcomes. And what I've learned through life is it's not so much what happens to you, it's what you tell yourself about what happens to you. I've mentioned beforehand the power of how you frame things in your life. The power of framing. If something goes wrong, are you looking for the lesson or are you beating yourself going, oh, I'm a failure? If somebody says something negative to you, do you go, oh, that's something bad about me? Or do you go, wow, they must be having a really bad day that they're looking for fault in me? Or do you take and go, oh, I wonder what I can learn from that feedback? The way we frame feedback on our pursuit towards achieving our goals and our dreams will help us to get there in a really positive mindset and in a way that builds us up and that sees every obstacle we come across as another step towards getting closer to what we want. My real encouragement for you from this Learning Byte is to check your sources of information. Are you getting reliable information from people who care about you and want the best for you? Are your reference points helping you or are they demotivating you? And are you being really careful with the way that you are translating and interpreting information that you are getting? Remember, it's not what happens or what you hear, it's what you tell yourself about what that means to you and to your pursuit of what you're trying to achieve. Here's to your success. Thanks so much for watching. If any of this resonated and you'd like to reach out, feel free to give me a call on 0272-987-523 or email me at mike at thinkright.co.nz or if you'd like some additional resources, go to our website www.thinkright.co.nz